Hello guys, and welcome back to a brand new video here today upon my channel, guys. Today, my friends, welcome to Stray, a brand new Let's Play here on the channel. I'll see you to this game, in case you didn't already know, is all about a cat who's in a mysterious world. That's all I'm going to say. It's all about this cat, and it's got apparently an amazing storyline to it. So, we're going to experience this today for the first time ever, and hopefully you will enjoy it. Let me know what your thoughts and opinions are on the game after today's video, and if you want to see even more videos on it, let me know down below in the comment section. Sneak boys. I'm so glad my cats are asleep at the moment because if they saw these cats on the screen, they'd probably be jumping at the screen. And I've got a headset in for it on purpose because the fact is, if they can hear cats, they're going to be thinking cats are nearby, not realizing it's the video game. There. Boy. Oh man, the audio to this game sounds amazing. Obviously, I am playing this on the PlayStation 4 as well. Oh, it's in the future. I will get a PlayStation 5 and play the PS5 version or the PC version because obviously I've heard that the current gen platforms it looks even better and sounds even better but obviously I do not know so I'll have to experience it maybe re 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 revisit this game again one day in the future I'll have to do that yeah you know I mean just to see what the the current gen versions are like So are these cats like stranded in a big world or something? Are they like stray cats? Obviously I know the game's called Stray, but stray cats like in a big apocalyptic world or something? Like a destroyed world? the wall. Okay. So is this, the, is this like this game scheduled like in chapters or something? So now we're back in full control, boys. This is awesome. Never thought I'd see the day that we're playing as a cat. Single fire, boys. Follow me. I've got a clue where we're going, but we're going somewhere. I'm loving the background music as well. It's, like, really, like, peaceful and... It's like an adventurous, like chilled soundtrack sharpen our claws just me scratching one's eyes out
Alright, so we're going up here. Okay, we've got some water. Come on, my friend, we're going this way. Just realize as well, we are quite high up as well, away from the floor, so. One wrong slip, and we're going straight down, boys. So we need to be very careful about our positioning when it comes to these high areas. So we hold down X, we can change them. Alright. Let's keep going. Yeah, what have you found, bro? Okay, there's nothing there for me to interact with. Looks like we're going straight ahead. I'm just loving the beauty of the world and everything, and the fact that you're playing as a cat. It's just unique and really cool. Like, uh, it's just something I wouldn't have never expected to see within 2022. I don't know why. I just never thought I'd see a game like this. But. From what it's worth so far, I'm really impressed with this. I think it's awesome. I've seen so many good reviews about this game as well. I just never had the proper chance to sit down, record, and play it. Come on, bro. You can do it. Oh. No! No, 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 no. Oh, don't tell me the cat's died. No. I thought my heart dropped, man. That's... That's... <laughs> I felt really devastated. No, man. That's... Oh, we're still alive. We're still alive, bro. You okay? You okay, little guy? Oh, we're hobbling. No, I mean... Me and my partner, we've got two cats, man. But I couldn't see a cat like that. Oh, cat's passed out. Bro. Can't treat cats like that. Oh, the bags are shaking. Are they like rats or something? Rats in the sewer. What the hell? Yo, that's not a rat. What the hell is that thing? I thought there were going to be rats inside bin bags and stuff looking scavenging for food or something. I wasn't expecting some like round thing with little legs. Was this like a futuristic sewers or something? But we had a really interesting intro to the game. You know what I mean? We're separated from our bodies, and we got to. I'm guessing we have to try and regroup with them. Seems like our legs are okay. 
So we're back in the game, boys. We're back in the game, and where the hell are we? Dead City. Ah, great. Is this, like, full of zombies or something? Alright. Yo, they're the little... things. Little, little alien things. Alright, let's just keep going ahead. Oh, okay. Just for giving me a sign, bro. Follow me. Right, so I guess I'm going this way. Got a uh, bucket here. some noise. I'm just going to keep knocking them all off. I'm my own person. I am my own cat. No one tells me what to do. If I want to knock paint off, I'll do it. Who's going to stop me? Definitely no human's going to stop me, that's for sure. Yo, more paint? Have some paint, bro. Criminal damage! That's definitely criminal damage. <laughs> Alright. It's got paint all over our feet. Got blue paws right now. You want to scratch um uh, do some of the carpet? Y'all scratching the carpet, oh boys. Destroy your furniture, we're gonna destroy your carpets. Pee on your furniture. I'm not even gonna use a litter tray. Screw it. Knock everything over because I can. Why not? Um, Y'all got some water here. Make sure we stay um, hydrated after all. Especially if we're exploring this like dead city. The bucket. Yo, these little alien things, man. I want to know what they are. What the hell are they? Yo, alien dudes. Oh, they're a robot. Alright, so someone's killed an, a robot. Them alien things have killed the robot. Surely. Okay. Yo. Yo, there's loads of them. Um. Okay, they're chasing me. Run, boys! Run! I'm getting out of here. Ah, come on, move, 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 move. You can do this, bro. You can do this. Oh, my days. Run, 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 run! What's new? What's the care? Whoa, 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 whoa. Yo, he's sucking the life out of me. A little gooey turds like sucking the life out of me. Get off me, get off me! I am gone, boys. I am gone. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. I'm hoping I'm going the right way, because if I'm not, then I'm running around for no reason. Run! 
Go, 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 go. Woo! Okay, we're still in the game, boys. Follow me. Okay. Whoever it is is trying to make contact with me. Are they an alien? Right, where are we going, boys? Right, I think we're going this way. Man, we're so high up. We need to be really careful of our positioning right now. Crazy. So hopefully you all enjoying the video so far guys. If you are then give this video a big fat thumbs up and subscribe if you're new. Let me know down below in the comment section if you've got any tips for me when it comes to playing Stray. Um, let me know your honest thoughts and opinions about the game. Don't give me any spoilers. Just let me know what you think of the game. If you played it, if you completed it. Let me know if it's got a really good ending to it, like a good story. Does it set it up for a sequel or anything? Let me know, but don't give away too much. Okay. I just want to know, like, what's your thoughts on it, mainly. And let me know if you want to see more parts on this in the future. I've heard this game's got a good length of gameplay to it. So, I'm down for it, boys, if you want this to be a full playthrough. I've just not got a clue where I'm going right now. I'm guessing we're going down, boys. Somehow. Let's go on, boys. Let's go this way. The camera's watching me. Someone's watching me on the cameras. Is it the alien? Is he robots? Oh, no, 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 no. I thought we were going to fall to his death then for the second time. I was just going to say, no. Don't do that to the poor little critter, you know what I mean? My bro just wants to make it through Dead City in one piece. I know cats have nine lives, like, but literally, if he fell to his death, then I would have been on seven. He's only fell once. Right, looks like we're going up, boys. Right, let's keep moving, see where this pathway leads us to. Watched on the cameras. Where the hell do I need to go? Oh, okay. So we're going through here. Oh, okay, so that turns the uh, fan thing off. Do I need to keep this thing I've got, though, or do I leave it there? I don't know. If it is, we have to come back for it. I'll just come back and get it. The flat. Okay. We're in someone's home right now. Need help? Yo, bro, can I go on Facebook? Yo, people far or far away, I'm giving you this distress message. Rescue me from Dead City. Please, bring me a chopper, plenty of catnip, plenty of cat food, please, send help, at once, <laughs> enter the door, turn on, and find a body, okay, watch this be like a serial killer's like flat or something, yo, this is like an abolitory, this is like a laboratory, man, yo, there's keys up there, Yo, I'm one of these bad boys. I'm guessing we're going to plug all these in. Alright. Yo, I think this belongs to me. 
Thank you very much. I appreciate if the cameras weren't staring at me. That would be nice. Or at least tell me who's staring at me. Another one. Come on, plug it in. A hidden room. Your boy's making progress so far. Got a robot in here sleeping. You alright, bro? You awake? Okay, his head falls off. He's definitely not awake. What the hell is this? It's like a little head. What do I do with this little head thing? Oh, hang on. Ah, okay. <sighs> so it reminds me of, it kind of reminds me of a ghost thing from Destiny. It kind of reminds me of that a little bit. Or oh, that little robot thing. Remember from the film, Flubber? Weebo. That's it. Weebo. Can you guys remember that film? Little robot that flies around. B12. Yo, my cat friend thinks it's a toy. Fight me, fam. You like an enemy or something? Are you broken? It worked, I'm free, thank you. I couldn't believe the camera's a cat in the dead sea. I can't remember my name, it seems my memory is corrupted. I've been trapped in an electronic network for so long, I know I've worked for a scientist who lived here. So now you can call me B12, that's what it says on my exterior. It's dangerous in the dead city, but you seem like you know how to handle yourself. Let's get out of here, follow me. Alright, sounds like a plan to me bro, let's get out of here. The key unlocks the door, I remember that much. Let me get that for you. Alright. Very good. Battery low already. Come over here. You have to put this on. Yo, my cat's having a nap, bro. It's a bit of ex extra weight on my back. My back was designed for a small quadrant like you. It's is it very uncomfortable for you? Don't worry, you'll get used to it. It's just like the key and stored it in the backpack. I'll open the inventory. Okay. So we've got keys. Easy. If you're ever curious about an object, you can show it to me. Or to others, and we'll come across any. Let's get out this flat. Okay. Stop the item. Looks like we're free, boys. We're free. Got a torch as well? Yo! We got his own little ghost thing from Destiny. Built-in torches, and we got a backpack as well for weaponry. Your boy's gonna run around with machine guns. Okay, codes 3748. Okay, so I'm going to try to remember that in case I need that. 3748. Okay, right. 3748. Let's do this. Hacking skills 101. Your boy has got skills. Let's do this. Oh, look at this place. The elevator is in the distance. That's important, I think. I know we need to get go up. Yeah, we got all the alien things below us. 
wherever the hell they are. My boy's just chilling, enjoying the ride. Them little pod things kind of remind me of something from Extinction within Call of Duty Ghosts or something. It's crazy, man. Wait, I remember the outside. Feels like I've been there before. Is this where you came from? I promised someone I would go there. I promised who? This postcard, the memorial was painted from it. Let's take let's take it with it. Let's basically take it with us. You gained a new item. A postcard. Why do I have these memories? How did they get here? Let's keep going. Alright, so there's going to be collectibles within the game. There's going to be memories that we need to recover. Alright. I'll keep an eye out for them all. Obviously, if there is any I do miss along the way, I do apologise. If you'd like me to make a separate video in the future collecting every single one of them, let me know. If not, enjoy the playthrough, my friends, because it's going to be fun. It's going to be interesting. Loads of these little alien dudes on the bottom. How's it going, bros? How's it going? <laughs> Try and jump for me. I've been trying to suck the life out of me. See you later. I am gone, boys. I am gone. Oh. Trying to catch me. Yeah. Trying to catch me. Yo, who's that? The slums. Howdy, my friend. Can you give me directions? It's okay. Okay. I guess they don't like cats. Yo, I don't mean you any harm, bro. Must need directions. Hello? Oh, everyone's just running away from me. It's because I'm a cat. Don't you like cats? Are you a dog person? Are you dog people? Do you speak English? Yo, I don't think these robot people like me. <laughs> Yo, is he a boss or something? Have we got to fight him? Put him up, bro. Seems to have their own language. You're no Zork? We're not familiar with your kind. You are welcome in our village as long as you don't eat anyone. <laughs> Alright. So I'm guessing them alien things are Zorks. I'm guessing. What do you need? Show them the item. A picture of the outside. Ridiculous. This elevator isn't operational. Everyone knows that it's impossible to leave this place. Well, except the outsiders. But they're all gone now, except Momo. You can try and talk to him if you want, but he gave up trying to leave. It's for the best. Okay. He lives high up in that building with the orange neon sign. Alright, I can see his uh, location. Alright, let's go where. Uh, let's go and meet Momo. Don't hesitate to call me anytime, I'm here to help. The Guardian told us to talk to Momo up in that big building with the orange neon sign. He's the only lead we got for getting out of here. 
All right. Let's go meet Momo. Up and at it. Let's go, my friends. Let's go. Your Momo. Yo, he looks sad. You okay, Momo? It's never going to work. Why did I let them go? I'm all alone now. Hey, you, what do you want? This is a picture of the outside. Do you want to go there? Well, don't bother, it's a waste of time. I'll bring you only loneliness and despair. My friends had this dream too, but now they're all gone, and I'm all alone. I don't know where they ended up. I tried to contact them, but that receiver doesn't work. My friends and I took notes from our research about the outside. Here, take mine if you really want. Okay, so Momo's notebook. You're on your own. I'm done with the outside. Good luck. Momo seems very sad about his friends. Let me check the notebook he gave us. The outside is manifest. We go outside at any cost. We must protect our brothers and sisters. We must stay away from Zor. It's signed Clementine, Doc, and Momo. We try and find the other notebooks. All right, let's try and find them. Let's get out of here, boys. Let's go find these notebooks. That symbol on the wall matches the one on the notebook. So we gotta look out for that symbol. Seems like a lead. Seems like there's one over there as well. I'm loving the soundtrack, it's pretty cool. Taking his notebook. So yeah, I'm hoping that the recording's going well, guys. Obviously, I have had a couple of technical difficulties recently with um, with my Elgato game capture card. So hopefully, there's no technical difficulties with the video or anything. If there is, I do apologise. But hopefully. The being, well, slowly being fixed. I see, I've been trying to experiment a little bit with my settings and stuff to see if that helps, but I'm just hoping that it looks all good on your end when you see this as a video. On my end at the moment, it's looking okay, but I just want to make sure, to the best of my capabilities, that none of the videos can get corrupted or anything. Now, let's go inside here. This place is like gold mine of books, man. Found the keys to your safe. You need to be more careful with these. Okay, so there's a safe. It's not enough to bury your safe behind a bunch of books. Just the librarian. Alright, so behind some books, there's gonna be a safe. She 
Here's the keys. And voila, my friends. Got another book. Nice. Another notebook. This one seems to belong to someone called Doc. After weeks of research, I've combined a spectrometer with a powerful UV lamp, which was already off the source on your way. Alright. Okay. Let's find the other notebooks. Okay. Let's keep an eye out for these other books, man. Right. Well, we've got to go over that in that direction over there, my friends. Just gotta keep uh, keeping out for the signs. And see where they lead us to. Let's pull this out. Hang on. Ventilation power supply. Find his notebook. Find the last notebook. This one seems to belong to someone called Zabaltazar. Zabaltazar. Okay. Found a design flaw in the transceiver, but I th think I figured it out how to fix it. He's the. Oh, this might be able to help Momo. Momo. Yo, Momo, we've got some good news, my friend. We've got some good news. Hey, little cat, are you looking for those useless notebooks? Oh, you found Clementine's notes. Really, really brave, you know, the most fierceless person I've ever met. But I never quite understood what he was talking about most of the time, but he was very wise. And ducks. Wait, you actually found all my friends' notebooks? Whoa, what's that note? That's, right, that's incredible, which means we should be able to communicate outside the slums. I doubt it, of course. I promise you I'll find a way to reach the surface. Thank you, we might be able to find you a way up. Let's fix this piece of junk. Transceiver. He's put in some long ass combination code. Yo, yo, bro, how long's that code? You got like a hundred digits or something? <clears throat> yep, so we've got to go to that building. If you install the transceiver at the very top of that tower, we should be able to communicate with the whole city. My friends might still be out there. If there is a way out, they'll know it. You're the only one small and quick enough to avoid the Zerks. We need you, little outsider. Bring us to the sky. You're the only one small enough and quick enough to avoid them. Alright. Let's do this, boys. Let's do this. On our epic little, little adventure. And obviously, if you guys are enjoying today's video, make sure you give it a big fat thumbs up and subscribe if you're new. Would really, really appreciate it. 
Let me know what you think of Stray so far. Hopefully we're all enjoying it. And fingers crossed we've had no technical difficulties so far. If we have, I do apologise. Fingers crossed we haven't though. Zork's over there. Full of neon. It's always straight and straight out, especially in the summers. People couldn't handle the constant darkness. One day somebody lit it up. Okay. <sighs> Another memory to add to the collection. Idea. Right, if I jump on this. Ah. Careful though, because them zorks are everywhere. Well, the zorks. Follow me, you shall see. Come on, day, jump, jump. Come on, bros, follow me. Now you definitely can't get me now, can you? Proper outsmarted him. <laughs> Fools. territory. Definitely. <laughs> These things are everywhere. Mm. Right, move, 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 move. Move, 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 behind me, behind me. Uh, go, 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 go. Jump. Come 
Little sign over here. Ooh. Knuckle call. They're responsible for waste management. The trash from the upper levels overloaded the slums. They tried to develop a bacteria. After the humans disappeared, the bacteria mutated, growing and eaten away. Now they're called Zorks. So basically, these enemies are made from bad bacteria. Like little alien bug things. Yeah, man, follow me. Fun little bugs, follow me. Trying to figure out how I'm gonna do this. Hang on. Follow me. Come on, you little things. Yeah, man. Follow me. Follow me. Oh, they're interested. Uh. Yep, they're definitely not interested. That's what it seems like. Squish him, squish him, squish him. No, 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 no. Alright, move, 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 move. Jump up. Come on, follow me, follow me, follow me. This way. Can you catch up with me? Come on, come on. Let's this cat can do parkour. <laughs> The elevator lift. Alright, we've got a lot of these enemies. Right, run, run, run! Come on! Just gotta keep them busy for five whilst we wait for this lift. Oh my days. No, 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 get off me. Last thing I want is these things killing me. Just gotta keep training them, training them around. Follow me. We got this, boys. We got this. Yo, try to catch me now, boys. Try to catch me now. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. I'm really enjoying this so far. I think this game's absolutely amazing. Well, let me know your thoughts and opinions down below in the comment section, guys. What do you think of part one for Stray? I think this game's brilliant. And I'm just hoping that everything's recording good. On my end, it's looking alright, but I want to see how it looks when you guys see this as a video. Hopefully, it's recorded properly and there's no technical difficulties. If there is, I do apologise. There's nothing I can do about it. I'm just trying to experiment and try and sort my Elgato out. I've even had thoughts of getting a brand new Elgato to see if that fixes the problem. Because I've had my old gas now for like, it must be about a good six, seven years now. Your boy's still running the um, Elgato HD. Back from like the PlayStation 3, 
the Xbox 360, Xbox One days, literally. Now I think nice and comfy. Look at the view, it's beautiful from, from here. I remember now the city was meant to be a shelter. It's okay, it, man. Those look like stars, but only light marking. The hermit roof sealing off the sea. Humankind built this shell to protect themselves from the outside, but it came at a cost. Nobody can go out. The outside was a disaster, completely barren, unlivable. But you came from there. It must mean it's safe again. And my promise wasn't just to go to the outside, it was to open the city. I still don't understand why some memories are coming back and others aren't. But I'm certain this is my purpose. I have to open the sea. Come on, let's go back and find Momo. Now we connected the transmitter. We should be able to. Right, let's jump on my little bucket ride. Let's go. was irritating my head then. Right. Slums part two. Get your boys get a ball. Uh, I'm going to know on the TV. Luke, a note. A little outside, if you're reading this, that means you're still alive. Excellent. I took some equipment to the bar to take advantage of the antenna. Come meet me there. I've locked the window, but the code to the open is quite simple. Okay. <laughs> That's one hell of a code. You can remember that code, bro. I couldn't. I was at the bar waiting for us. All right, let's go find the bar. All right, so we can't jump down from there. So we've got to make his way naturally down. Come on. I'm guessing the bar's on the ground floor or something, or something along the lines of that. Come here, I managed to get a signal. Alright. Come show me what you got, Momo. Let me see if I can get this thing working. Got it. Hello, can you hear me? Hello, yes, we can hear. We are from the slums. We're looking for a way out. Wait, is that you? Is that Balsa? Momo? I can't believe it. I'm so happy to hear your voice. Where are you? Are the others okay? Yes, we are safe. We found a way up. 
Can you still hear me? You have to go for the sewers to reach us. Very dangerous. Zorks everywhere. Sewers? House? Hello? Darn it, we've lost the signal. I can't believe it. He and the others outside has managed to go up through the sewers. The sewers are a very dangerous place in slums. In the slums, but if they've made it, there must be a way. You never get past the sewers, it's infested with zorks. They'll make a quick meal out of you, especially you, little one. Many tried their luck in the past, it doesn't end well. Anyway, I warned you, your business is none of my business. Alright. His father, Doc, used to be a great scientist. He's working on some new weapon to fight the Zorks. A few years ago, he went off to test the device and never came back. Samos has never been the same since. Hmm. A new weapon, eh? Don't listen to Samos, he's just scared like it, like I was. If Doc built a weapon, that's our ticket to join the Outsiders. It's in, the, in his notebook, the Doc mentioned a secret lab a few times. It must be where he was working on it. That might be a clue in Samos' apartment. Come on, follow me. Alright, so we go to this guy's apartment. Okay. Okay. We'll look around. Right. Right behind you, bro. Come on. Mm. Mm. Wow, I feel so tired today. I need to start like proper sorting my sleep schedule out just so that I can be a little bit more awake during the day. Expected. The situation is pretty tough on Seamus. He doesn't want to hear about the outsiders anymore and he won't help me. But you? I think I have an idea. Here, take Doc's notebook and show it to Seamus. It contains a lot of information that might hopefully act as a Find the secret lab, little outsider. I'm going back to the bar to try and establish communication with the others. Alright. Yo, you. Read this notebook. We need to talk. Help me find this weird lab. I told you game for the sewers is a suicide mission. Leave me be. What's that? Wait, it's my papa's? Oh, wow. I never knew. There's a secret room here in our flat, but where? Y'all, secret combination, boys. Alright, so there's going to be a code. I'm guessing it's going to be written somewhere. Yo, what the hell is this? Time will tell. Ah, oh, okay, the clocks, the clocks. So, we've got... Well, well, sixteen, sixteen. Oh no, two, five, one, one, two, five, one. 
2511 or 2512. Yo, your boy's got detective skills. So we found the secret laboratory room, my friends. We found it. Let's see what this doc's been up to. never seen this room. I can't believe he managed to hide it from me all this time. These blueprints must be for my for his Zerg weapon. He told me the weapon's working in theory, but he never he needed a real life test. He went outside the slums and never came back. So your father's still out there? Bro, where's we need to find him? So it's officially no longer under control. They now eat metal. Light based handgun. Low priority about visual appearance size. Okay, so that's like a blueprint on how to build the weapon. Yo, what's this? Okay, there's nothing in there. Let's keep looking around in case there's any boxes or anything we need to knock over. A broken tracker? Find anything interesting in there? Broken tracker. Wait, I remember that. That's his tracker. Papa used to use that tracker to keep an eye on where I was. Maybe we can reverse it and find where he went. I can't believe my papa might still be alive. I've missed him so much. You need a weapon for the Zorks? Right, my papa definitely took one with him. I just need to repair the tracker so we can find him. Someone in slums should be able to help. Come with me, I'll open the door for you. Alright, so we got to try and fix this tracker, okay? We're making some good progression with the story, man. It's so good. I'm loving it. It's like, it's like puzzle after puzzle after puzzle. It's so good. You gotta fix the track of your resource, but maybe you can find someone in the slums to help. Alright. So we need to find somebody. So let's go and like speak with people and see what we can find. You right, bro? Do you know anyone who can help me fix the tracker? Wait, that thing is a tracker. I don't know anything about high tech stuff. Check the bar, okay. Let's go check the bar. Howdy, howdy. Grandma made me a scarf. Isn't it wonderful? She knits so well. Your track is in bad shape. Bartender might be able to help you with some, find someone who can fix it. Alright, speak with the bartender. Howdy, bro. You're new around here. What can I do for you? That's a beautiful object. A rare one, too. I know a guy who fixes stuff like this. He's very talented. Well, a little. You'll see. His name's Al Elliot. His office is just left on me here, next to Grandma's shop. There's a sign all over his door. Well, signs all over his door. Okay. So, you can find Elliot. You right, Momo? I'm really struggling to get the connection back. Did you find anything? Interesting device, but it looks like it's broken. Maybe someone in the village can help you repair it. Alright, so we've got to go find Elliot. So we've got to find Grandma's shop, and then look for a door with loads of signs on it. Hang on. Let's look around first to see. Let's do a little bit of exploring first. Let's see what else there is in the sea. Howdy, howdy. So if today's yes, well, so today's yesterday's tomorrow. Whoops, I'll suck on my ancestors. You can fix your tracker. That kid Elliot who lives there is a tech, real tech whiz. Okay. Cheers, Rosie. I feel like I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> and if I am, then I'm an idiot. But still, let's keep looking around. Leave 
bit of exploring. Okay, let's me back here. Remember? R.I.P. humans. Humans were the first residents. Alright. <clears throat> okay, so we can't go in there. Right, let's go this way. So we can't go that way. That shit's the next day. It's crazy, right? I can't eat anything. Alright. Um. <laughs> What's this? Alex program. Knock on the door and wait for us to open. Knock, knock. Howdy, howdy. <clears throat> Meat? You let me in, please? Are you Elliot? Yo, bro, are you Elliot? You're here for Elliot. He's just over there. You should show that to Elliot. Oh, you're Nesta. Okay. Right, so I'm guessing he's upstairs. And Yo, Elliot. Yes, how can I help you? Oh, wow, that's a great tracker. I recognize this model. You could track anyone with this little gadget, may I? I don't know how to repair it, but it's trembling. It could use my keyboard, but I'm sick or something. But I definitely don't feel right. I can't work with it when I'm shivering like this. I think I need a blanket to be able to fix your tracker. Alright. I'm gonna get this guy a blanket. Hang on! That grandma person knits things. Can we go to grandma's shop and speak with grandma to see if she'll knit him a blanket? Or she's got a blanket, but it be in a shop. That might be a good sign. But where is grandma's shop? Yo. Let me be a scarf. Isn't it wonderful? She knits so well. Yo, where can I find grandma? And you guys know where Granny is? Howdy, howdy. Oh, Grandma, I do love knitting, but I'm so. F I've knitted 470. Maybe some electric cable, and I could make you a poncho. You inspire me, but it's not easy to find the right materials around here. Okay, so we need electric cable. Alright. Um, uh, where can I find an electric cable? Can make us something if we get a cable. Explore sums, we should be able to find someone who sells cable. Howdy, howdy. You want something? Pretty stylish, no? Alright, I need a cable. I need a cable. Where the hell can I find a cable? Yo, bartender man, do you know where I can find cables? Hmm. Man, there's gotta be answers around here somewhere. Yo, do you know where I can find cables? Okay. 
what's happening to you, mate. I don't dare to leave our village, it's too dangerous. Besides, the Guardian is the only one who can open this door. Ah, okay. <sighs> Yo. Look at all the great stuff that falls into our trash. So many treasures. You can go to the bottom, man. Okay. Bottom, man. Yo, bro. How's it going? You look lost. What do you need? Uh. Howdy, howdy. So I can't speak to all of them. Thought you could take the elevator. It's never seen that thing work. And I've been three, 374 years this person's been here for. Alright. Yeah, what's over here? <gasps> Cable! Merchant. You give me something, I'll give you something in exchange. It's as simple as that. This is a set of electric cable, the best in the market. I'll exchange a super spite detergent. That's the best I can do. Okay, so we've got to find a super sprite detergent. Okay. Um... Hidden gems and pennies. Hmm. Interesting. Just find some detergent from the beta man. Maybe we can find some at the laundry. Oh, laundromat. How do we get inside? Oh, I think I know where that is. Um, I think I know where that is. It was a room that's on the ground floor somewhere, which has got like a bit of a sign thing on it. I think it's that room. I'm going. One, two, eight, three. Hang on. Got anything in here for me, bro? Anything I can take? Please, I'm thirsty. I need something cool. Yo, jukebox. How do we get inside? Right, let's go find the laundromat. Or the laundrette, I believe it's properly called. Um, i trying to remember where it is. I know it's on the ground floor somewhere. That part I do know. I think it's this building here. Ah. someone in there as well who doesn't seem very happy so we've got to find a way getting in um oh i've got an idea what about the paint there's those guys up there maybe they can help i've noticed there's paint as well up there maybe we can knock it off or something get the person's attention hang on
Right, so the door's open. This is my ticket, guys. This is my ticket. I need to get out of here. I need to get down to that room, just in case they go back inside. Right, come on. Get down. Right, jump down, jump down, jump down, jump down. Come on. Excuse me. Right, looks like we're inside, boys. We're inside. We've got it. Right, so now we need to go get that cable. We get that cable, we go see Grandma, see Grandma, then we go back to Elliot. That's the plan, my friends. That is the plan. And your boy's got toys. Because that's what cats have. They love toys. Right, thank you for doing business with your boys. Uh, enjoy picking all that paint up because, you know, I ain't picking it up. I'm a cat. We don't we don't clean things up. We make mess. Right. I got you a prezi. Let's exchange. What do you want now? There's a secret. Uh, okay, right. Here you go. Electric cable. Right, let's go see... Hang on. That's an ancient relic testament. Three energy drinks or less. Oh, okay. Right. Let's go see Grandma. Yo, 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 yo. Don't mind me, boys. They're just exploring Dead City while well, the slums and looking for Grandma. Yo, Granny, I got you something. You got to wait right away. Nice. A panacho. Right, now we need to go to Elliot. This would hopefully warm him up a bit. Um, Elliot is here. Knock, knock. Let me in. Come see my boy, Elliot. Yo, Elliot, I've got something to keep you warm, bro. Fix my tracker for me, please. No traumas, I'm able to work again. No, no tremor, sorry. Uh, I'll give it an update. Oh, one more thing. Voila! Fix tracker. There you go, little one. Good luck finding who you are looking for. Thank you very much, Elliot. Right, so we got a tracker working, boys. And. Hang on. Remember. Tree is a scientific marvel. Just jamming away. Alright, so we've got another memory, boys. Another memory. Right. We've made some really good progression for on today's video so far. I'm hoping that every single one of you out there are enjoying today's video. If you are, then give this video a big fat thumbs up and subscribe if you need. We'd really, really appreciate it, guys. Like I said, I do apologize for any technical difficulties on today's video. Obviously, I'm still in the process of making sure my Elgato works. I see this has been having a few technical difficulties lately. As you've probably seen in some of my previous videos. But... I'm hoping to get a proper fix for it. I do think the possible fix will be for me to upgrade and get a better Algato because I'm still using my old Algato for many, many, many years ago. You know what I mean? I've been on YouTube now for what, like seven, eight years? And I'm still using my Algato from back then. You know what I mean? I always I always have the saying, if it, wor if it still works, then why upgrade? Why change it? But I do feel like it might be the right time for me to get a new Algato. If it is that I can't fix it. Did you manage to find the tracker? Well, fix the tracker. Yes, I did. You fixed it. Well done. Give it here. We 
got a ping. It's Papa really alive? I can't believe it. Let's follow the track and maybe we'll find where my Papa went. Alright, bro. Alright, let's go find your dad. Let's go find Papa. in the back in me as well, it's amazing. Must be it. He really left the slums. It's dangerous out there, but it must be sure. I must be sure. Let's do this. I thought only the guardian can open that door. Maybe the guardian doesn't know that we're leaving. This is crazy, man. This is crazy. So we're leaving the slums. We're going into the Zork's nest, basically. You coming with me on the whole journey, bro? Want to assist me on my mission? To find your papa? All these Zork's eggs. They'll eat us. I can't do this. I'm not as fast as you, the Zorks will get me for sure. Take this badge, my papa will recognize it. He'll know that you're a friend. I'll open the door for you. <clears throat> Alright. Appreciate the assist, bro. I'm a one-man team now. Good luck. My little cat outsider, we got a mission to do. Fine, Papa. But anyways, guys, what I'm going to do now, because we've made so much progression within this part, I'm going to bring this video to an end. If you have enjoyed part one, give it a big fat thumbs up and subscribe if you need. would really, really appreciate it. I've got plenty more content still to come to keep your eyes and ears locked onto the channel every single day for a brand new video. And if you want to see part two real soon, then make sure you look out for it. And I'll get around to recording it as soon as possible. Got more Let's Plays, more fan-made games, so much more coming to this channel. And also check out the link in the, in the description as well on this video. It'll take you over to my main channel where I make Call of Duty content, Realm Royale content, Apex Legends mobile content, and so much more. So if you want to see more content, check out my main channel, subscribe to that as well. Anyways... Take care, have a great day, and I'll see you again next time.